Hi guys, what's going on? It's the Digital Tutor here with another step-by-step -step tutorial. In today's video, I'm just going to show you how to change the Windows 10 font. So this is basically like the style of lettering. Um, if you find this video helpful today, please leave a like and drop a comment below. And if you are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more step-by-step -step tutorials, how-tos and tips and tricks for everything tech and digital related. So in order to do this, uh, what you're going to want to do first is come down to the search box down in the bottom left hand corner and then you just want to type font and then click on to font settings up here. So to do it, you can actually just click on one of these fonts and it's going to change it. Uh, there's actually something you need to do. But you, what you want to do first is come across to this screen because you want to select the font that um, basically you want to change it to. So for example, I'm going to go for, let's go for this one, Kandara, as an example. Uh, what you can do when you click on it, you can actually type some words in at the top search box. And that's going to show you all the different ways it's going to show up, like for italic, for bold, uh, normal writing, etc, etc. And then what you want to do is just uh, keep this screen up. And what I'm going to do is leave this in the video description down below but what you're going to want to do is open up a notepad so you would just come down to the search box type notepad and open up this app and if you copy the code from the description down below the video description and what you need to do is paste this onto your notepad like so and there's only one thing we need to change which is if you look right down the bottom here um, where it says new font, we want to replace that with the name of the font we want to replace it to. So what I'm going to do is just delete the new font. I'm going to leave the quotation marks there and I'm just going to put Kandara. And then what we're going to do is click onto file at the top and then we want to go to save as. And then what you want to do is just choose where you want to save this. The best place is probably on the desktop. So if you go and click on desktop. And what you want to do is save this as a registry file. So to do that, you want to call it something like Kandara font. And then you need to put dot reg. So save as type, you can leave this as text. That's absolutely fine. That's no problem at all. And then all you want to do is come down and click on to the save button. So once that's done, you'll see that's actually been added to the desktop. If I just uh, minimize this a minute. So this is the file it's created up here, Kandara font. And to actually apply this, all you want to do is double click. And then it's going to come up asking you to accept the permission. Just click yes. And what's going to happen is that's going to add the font to the registry. And all you need to do to actually apply the font is just go ahead and restart your computer. And once you've done that, you'll be able to um, see the new font. So I hope you found that helpful. And if that did help, please leave a like and drop a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And if you do want to help support the Digital Tutor channel, there is a link in the video description down below. And if you go and give that a click, you'll be able to buy the team here a cup of coffee. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you in the next one.